Okay, so here is what to do in case your iPhone storage is full. Now, you can manage and check out if it's full by getting the pop-up, most likely, but also if you go to the uh, settings and in the general section, you can get to the iPhone storage. And within here, you have a little, like, drop-down menu, or you, you can see it visually on how much storage you have left and what are the other sections which are taking up your current storage. So you have to pay attention to this and you can manage the biggest like um, storage takers in here. So in case you have it like me, you have iPhone photos, you can just come back to the photos app and either back them up or delete the uh, big large videos and files which could take up a lot more storage than it's probably necessary. Then you also have other apps and even the files between, I mean, within those apps. So for example, the Final Cut camera is a camera application, but it doesn't necessarily have this size on its own. It's also with the files in here. So you can also manage it right there. So not only the app as it is, but also the documents and size within it play a crucial role. You can see in this case, like uh, the app size is very small, but the data, like the videos recorded within this application are taking up a, l a large uh, amount of space. So of course you need to delete a couple of different things to free up the storage, but most likely it's gonna be photos or apps. However, in case you wanna keep the photos, you can also back them up and there are multiple ways to do it. You can literally just get the iCloud, and upload all of your photos there, right? So if, if in case you sync your iPhone to iCloud, all of your photos are just gonna appear in the cloud. Keep in mind that it's not gonna work with the basic plan because that one is limited to five gigs only and it's po possible that you have more photos than that. So they are gonna ask you to upgrade your iCloud account and pay monthly for it. Okay, so that's something to, to pay attention to. Also, besides that, there are other like uh, cloud services. You can upload photos to like Google Photos or even just place them on a drive or a Dropbox or something. And you can make sure you keep the files uh, and you can delete them on your phone. So that's what you need to do. Hope you like this video. Hit the thumbs up if you did. Subscribe below and I'll see you in the next video.